So there is a, a new uh, songwriter singer who's become quite famous in country music, Brandy Carlisle. I don't know if you're familiar with her. She is uh, really a, an amazing uh, person, and she's written some great songs. In 2018, she wrote and performed a very healing song for anyone who needed healing from a broken heart in their love life. And I, I find this song very gratifying as 40 two years ago, 43 years ago, someone broke my heart and left me. Now I just want to thank her because my beloved Ann Benson showed up shortly afterward, 43 years ago. So this song took me back though. Yeah, I, I, I hit the jackpot, I know. <laughs> this song took me back to the pain of that period. I was really devastated. I, I was the first time I'd ever been depressed and it taught me to believe in miracles. I was in a traveling band on the road with my former partner and two other band members. We played all over the country for five years. And obviously having my career tied up with my sweetheart meant my whole way of life was in jeopardy when she left. The band did break up and I needed a new career, a new life, and a new wife. <laughs> so I called the only lesbian couple I knew. I mean, this was in 1979. Uh, they were. Uh, Texans who I had met while teaching school on the Navajo Reservation at Rough Rock, Arizona. They had moved back to their native land of Fort Worth, Texas. So Lynn and Kathy told me on the phone, don't worry about this. Just come to Texas, you'll meet a Texas sweetheart, and you'll be happy the rest of your life. <laughs> Voila! <laughs> that was French <laughs> in a Texas accent. <laughs> But, but sometimes, maybe you, as well as me, just wonder, whatever happened to that person who hurt me so badly? But you know not to follow up with that thought, because you just hope they're happy, and if we are smart, for our own sake, we forgive them. 